so here's what happened to me um, my subscription expired on this scan tool and when that happened I was not able to use the scope and it told me um, when I hit the start button actually this screen sh or I'll put, a, I'll put the picture right here I took a picture of it um, this is the message that I got and I was no I was no longer able to update the scope uh, through this app on the scan tool so when I got that message I came up to here and I actually did both of these and I wasn't able to do it so I then went to Facebook went to the Autel group and that's where I got um, directed from Tim to do it on the laptop through the um, PC so basically um, I already did it I did the update it's functioning now perfectly but what you have to do I guess if the subscription expires is you're gonna have to download this app onto the PC which is kind of a pain but at least it worked for me um, so here's what I did so you're gonna go to Autel's website it's gonna be very slow unfortunately I'm extremely far from my router but then I went to support and updates so type in MP408 in that search bar and then I selected this one Autel update tools so you're gonna come over here you're gonna click on the max maxi scope you're just downloading the scope software onto your PC and then you should have a file pop up over here at the corner somewhere on your computer opening so setup oh man let me zoom out so you guys can see this and follow through so you're gonna hit setup so I double clicked on that run anyway so English United States yes so now it's going to prepare to install this file. So basically before you even get to this point, what I would recommend doing is figuring out where you want to put this file. Um, I made a folder for it. Okay, so I made a folder on my desktop and I named it Autel, so I'm going to select that and hit OK. And then hit Next and then hit Install. I forgot to mention um, <clears throat> in the user manual for the scan tool, I think on page 126, um, it does talk about this for the for updating your um, your scope so hit finish now once that's completed you should be able to go to your desktop I don't know wherever you're gonna put your put your scope so what I did so this is why I made a, um, a separate folder for it is because it's gonna dump a bunch of files all over your desktop if you don't make a folder or it's going to be kind of hard to find if you don't I just would recommend just making a separate folder and so you could dump it in here but here's your scope I'm gonna double click that and open it so from here what I had to do is I had to disconnect the scope from the scan tool and connect it directly to the laptop And then, uh -oh. I just maximized the window, but and then, so once your scope is connected, uh, make sure that you have a green light. 
I guess it's flashing. I did notice it flashing when it was doing the update. Um, I came to here. I came to help, I believe. Check update. And I selected online. So make sure you have internet access. Um, I selected online. So after the update, I just disconnected the scan or I mean the scope from the computer here and I connected it back up to my scan tool. And as you can see, it's working properly again. I wasn't able to um, I wasn't able to do that before this update. So it is working properly. Um, so I hope this video does help you guys. I did receive some extra help. Um, if you guys have Facebook, you could find there is an Autel support group on Facebook that you guys could join. Um, you guys could check them out and they will help you if you guys need any help with these scan tools or any questions or concerns. They are able to um, give some pretty, pretty good feedback. Uh, so don't forget to like and subscribe.